What's up gamers and welcome back to my YouTube channel where we're going to continue our playthrough of Beyond Two Souls. If this is your first time joining in for our Beyond Two Souls playthrough, make sure you hop over to episode one so you don't have any spoilers. Today we are going to dive back into learning more about Jody. The last time that we played, we had not only good but bad decisions that we had to make and some that I honestly didn't even have a chance to decide because I was too indecisive. So today we're going to try to make as many decisions as we can before the game is able to complete it for us as well as try to make Jody's life a little bit easier. Why don't we dive into today's episode and see how many good and bad choices we can make in this episode of Beyond Two Souls. Too far away. She's still sketched out because I pulled out her uh, paper. Nothing? You fell asleep? Okay. Days. Okay, I'm tired. Am I supposed to keep doing stuff? Unexpected stop. important to make such a fuss. Game from the top, highest priority. She's CIA on the run. Wanted for treason. At least that's what I heard. This manhunt I ever seen. She ain't gonna get very far. <laughs> Routine check. Can I see your IDs, please? Go, go, go. Man, return to your seat, please. Shit! That's her! That's her! Go! Watch out! Everyone ah. down! 
<laughs> Only a little bit. fights I never know which way I'm supposed to go because I'm under pressure and I only have a certain amount of time so I panic but we got off the train With only a couple stra scratches and we're not dead so that's good yeah I know we gotta get out of here before they come back well the train's going a really fast like the train's going really fast so you'll be fine
I don't want to hurt a dog. I really, 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 really don't want to hurt a dog. Please, please don't make me. Please don't make me. No, please, no. I don't want him. I don't want him. Oh. For the safety of me. Oh God. I don't like this. I don't like this. I don't like this. I don't like this. Oh, my heart. My heart. Go. No, please. It's just a game. It's just a game. It's just a game. Okay, least favorite part of that game. Or least favorite part of this game. Oh, I hated that. Uh, where am I supposed to go? Am I supposed to go up this way? Where the hell did she go? I don't know where I'm supposed to go. <coughs> Wrong way. <coughs> Am I supposed to be climbing up here? Okay, climb. See anything yet? Come on. Back. I really don't want to. I suppose go this way, maybe. <sighs> yep. Go for it, Iden. Maybe. Oh, it's Iden's turn. Oops. God damn rain. Look like it's ever gonna. What's over here? Motorbike. Just what I need. good. Jesus, Mike! What the fuck? Are you crazy? Put the fucking gun down now! Hey! What the fuck are you doing? Go, go, go!
Didn't know I was gonna ride, drive a motorcycle today. Get me. 
Tell them to leave me the fuck alone, because next time, I'll kill everyone. I mean, you killed quite a bit of people there. Come on, Aiden. I think they get the message. We're back to childhood. Aiden, or however you say the, the imaginary friend, comes into contact with Jody. Hey, honey. You can't spend the whole day looking out the window. Why don't you find something to do? Jody. So I think it's around the holidays with how the house is decorated. We do love a good old fireplace. On the couch. Is that doing something? Does that count? Watch a little bit of TV. Ooh. Does that just turn into a person? 
no. I didn't like that. That just wasn't entertaining. We have some toys you can play with? Maybe we can help mom in the kitchen. Color her a picture? What's over here? Ooh, can I have a cookie? Can I have a cookie? It's almost dinner time, sweetheart. If you eat a cookie now, you'll eat your dinner. But what if I promise to eat, eat my dinner? Ugh, I just wanted a cookie. Okay. I'm channeling my inner Jody. What would we want to do? Do we want to sit right here? Well, I guess that's just looking out the window still. But look how pretty it is outside. The snow is falling. We have decorations. It's really pretty. Can we go play out in the snow? Let's go check upstairs and see what we can find. Because our room's upstairs, I believe. Is this the bathroom? Maybe we can wash our hands. Draw a picture, maybe, for mom. Keep ourselves busy while, you know, mom cooks dinner. Go nowhere near mirrors. Oh. Okay, that's an interesting photo. About playing with dolls. Would that be fun, maybe? Hey, Fairy Blossom. Do you want to come over to my house for tea? Are we jumping up and down? Oh, yes, I'd love to. I guess we do I'll have to animate that we're talking. I love your car. That's a pretty carriage. Yeah, I chose it myself, and it goes really, really fast. Really, really fast. Okay. Is it like a wind up one? We're here. Come on, let's go this way. She is so cute. She just wants to play what imagination. Imaginary. Yeah. Tea party, you book. know? My husband gave it to me for my birthday. Oh. Would you like some sugar in your tea, Fairy Blossom? Oh, no, thanks. And how is your husband? He's good. He's working. <gasps> oh! This went from cute to creepy. Why, he's so handsome. Stop that, Ivy. I told you I didn't want to play with you anymore. Okay. Did not like. <coughs> <clears throat> Did not like it. Go back downstairs to mom. Wait, there's another room we can check. Never know what kind of achievements you're gonna get when you explore, but I'm also nervous. What if there's, oh, there's two rooms to explore. Is this mom's room? Ooh, there's a mirror. I don't want to. I don't want to go near the mirror. Jody, honey, would you do me a favor? Could you get me a bottle of oil from the garage? Yes, mom. Uh, yes. Sure, no problem. Bottle of. Did she say bottle of oil? Let's just put some makeup on first. <laughs> Hey, 
No. No, I didn't. Oh. Mom is going to be mad if we mess with her stuff. Okay, let's get get out of here. I don't want to get Jody in trouble. I really don't want to get Jody in trouble. But I do want the achievements. Oh wait, we have to go help mom. I want the achievements and I want to help my mom. I don't want to make her mad. Maybe she'll give me a cookie if I'm nice. What is that? Something up there. What was that? Is that a phone? Hello? Hi, how are you? I'm fine, thanks. This weather is terrible. I think it's nice All now. this snow? I hope it'll end up soon. Kids are so difficult when they can't go outside. I didn't stop that. I don't think she's a fan of Aiden. Is that her dad? Please, Jody, I'm working. You seem like a real number one dad. Piece of frickin' work. Notice the sarcasm when I say number one dad. Please, Jody, I'm working. No. All right, we're going to go out to the garage. At least mom's nicer to us. I would think I would have to go out back, right? What about your boots and stuff? Don't you have to go put your boots and stuff on first? I would think. I walked right past those. Jody, where are you going? Oh, wrong way. Uh, nowhere. I was just looking outside. I went the wrong way. Jody, did you get me the oil? I'm on my way to get it. I'm sorry. Coming. I'm distracted. Open the wrong door. Come on, honey. I gotta get dinner ready. You just told me that I had to get you oil, but it's not letting me go outside. She said garage, right? I would think that I would have to go outside, wouldn't I? Oh, maybe? No, 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 no. I think I know where it is. There was a door over here. Is it this door? Yep. I passed this door. That's creepy. I need some oil. Ooh, not a fan. Not a fan. Okay. Here's the oil. heavy and it's really cold in here all of a sudden go 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 just ignore it all just eyes straight ahead that door is closing that door is closing that door is closing come on grab it that was sketchy no thank you Go, mom. Thanks, sweetheart. Of course, I love you. See, she's so sweet. Can I go out this door now? Hey, sweetheart. 
Why don't you go outside and play? I'll call you when dinner's ready. I was Honey, just getting ready to do that. Put your coat on. It's freezing out there. Okay, fine, Mom. I suppose I should do that. I thought it was going to do it automatically for me. All right. Oh my gosh, you look so cute all bundled up. I want to go build a snowman. Do you want to build a snowman? I'm going. Great. Now I can be bored and freezing. But you don't care, do you, Aiden? You never get cold. Can I swing? Will you push me, Aiden? It's not fun anyway. I give up, I give up. Hey, I surrender. Did she not? I thought she, maybe I just didn't do it good enough. Come on, let's get it. Hey, did you hear that? Came from the what? street. Idiot. Attack me. What? Attack me? Come on, let's get him. Can we peek over? Snowball gotcha. fight? I think I just found a way to have some fun. I'm gonna make you pay for that. Take that. <laughs> okay, I know we're not supposed to. Come on, we'll just play for five minutes and come back. Mom will never know. Okay, let's go, uh, let's go play with the kids. I guess. I don't want to get in trouble, but... Hey, wait for me! <laughs> oh. Maybe we can't jump the you fence. Mom's gonna see hand, us. Aiden. Mom's gonna see us. Hey, that's cheating. Aiden, you're the best. Don't you? Okay. Okay. You do you. Hey, Joe, do you want to play with us? Come on, hurry up and hide. Then you're gonna get cream. Did I just hit somebody? Come on, idiots! Gotcha. Attack me! Ow! Ouch! Gotcha! Got her! <laughs> Take that! Oh, I got him! Ha ha! Be good. Dude, uh, I don't know if we should hurt the little boy. Wait, 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 wait. I didn't want that to happen. Did you see that? She nearly killed me. Mm, not exactly. You saw what she did to me? She's a witch. A dirty, rotten witch. What's going on here? She's a witch! I'm telling you! Jody Holmes is a witch! What are you 
talking about? Come on, let's go. Come on. Get in the house. I don't like her dad at all. What happened? What were you doing in the street? You know you're not allowed to leave the yard. I saw the other kids playing. I, I just wanted to have some fun. What did you do to that boy? Philip. I didn't do anything. I didn't do it. He was trying to defend me. He thought... I'm sick and tired of your stories. Jody, this time you're really gonna get it. Help you! Go to your room. Now! I want to hit him. Try to get some sleep, sweetheart. Everything will be better in the morning, okay? Night night. I like the mom. Besides the fact Mommy. that she didn't stand up for her. I'm afraid of the monsters, Mommy. They're gonna get me. And you know monsters don't exist. But I'll leave the light on and the door open, okay? Get some sleep, sweetie. I feel the tossing and turning though. Sometimes sleeping's hard. Okay. Don't like this. Bugga bunny. Is she feeling better now? I don't want to call the Ida and get her yelled at again. Monsters didn't exist. You were wrong, Mommy. You were wrong. Oh. All right, we're back to like teenager, young Johnny, adult. Get up. Huh? What? What's going on? Get dressed. I'll explain in the car. Okay. The DPA has launched a program to study the other side. The infrabolt, as they call it. They've created a condenser, a machine to open a rift to what lies beyond. They've opened a passage? To Aiden's world? Something happened last night. Entities got through the rift and we couldn't shut down the condenser. Everybody in the building was slaughtered. None of the rescue teams came back. They called and asked for your help. I told them you were just a child, that it was too dangerous. But they know only you know how to deal with what lies beyond the rift. Um. Go ahead. Jody, if you don't want to do it, just say, and I'll take you back. 
You don't understand. She's the only one that can stop this. It's fine. I got this. Oh, we got I like her jacket or her vest. Is that the girl? I'm sorry, Miss. I you heard there's something. Come. She can go. Oh, I'm sorry. Let's do this. I'm ready to go. Not yet. We have to okay. He's so far girl? ahead of me. Which girl? Why do I love Jody so much? Okay, so I have to go into the, the basement area, they said, right? I just want to look around first. I don't know about you, Aiden, but I'm scared. So I would think he's semi good, at least towards Jody. Because if they're linked together, then I would assume if anything happens to her, something would happen to him. Okay, so there's nothing in here. Gotta love the blood splatter as we're walking down. He did say she was scared for a reason. She's probably only like 16 or 17 here. Maybe a little bit older. Okay, we're going to the ground level. Great. Oh, the elevator's stuck. Well, can we take the stairs? Go see what you can do, Aiden. Oh, okay. But no, I'd find some stairs. Come on, Jody, you got this. Taken out by 
by a suitcase. The suitcase that was in the door. Well, looks like we're gonna go down to the restricted libraries area, or laboratories area. All these flashing alerty sounds, we shouldn't worry about it, right? I'm sure it's fine. I'm sure there's nothing to worry about here. Nothing at all. Why is my camera like this? Why is my camera zoomed in like this? Okay, that was interesting. <laughs> oh! Go! Nothing but death in there! It's fine. Pretty sure the last words he just had of his life was to warn us, but we're gonna go in anyways. I'm sure there's nothing to worry about in this hallway. Not the fire in front of us, not the dead bodies, or the fact that the wall... from the other side. I know. I can feel it too. They're here. Stay close to me, okay? There are ducks in the ceiling. If I can get up there. Climb up 
this? Yeah, you can. Maybe? Push it, push it to the limit, limit. Yeah, I know we're gonna need iron here. I got you. Let me get that for you. Now you can go ahead. <laughs> Iden is very helpful. We all need a little bit of an Iden in our lives from time to time. actually a good idea, especially since we don't have any proper equipment, but you know, <coughs> I'm sure it's fine. That tells me otherwise. extinguisher. There's got to be one around here somewhere. Well, Find it, Aiden. Yeah, so about that. Right here.
closer over here. Maybe I just was out of range. I'm Jody. I, I work with Professor Dawkins. The entities. They invaded the laboratory. Creatures from the depth. I, I managed to hide, but they're still here. I know they're still here. You're not. Try to get to the elevator. I mean, it's, it's working now. You, you should be able to get out. You're staying here? But those things, those, th those things will kill you. I'm not alone. We always face death alone. of this video if you made it to this point because this girl deserves all the love holy crap let us out for christ's sake entities can go through matter this won't stop them sorry can't take that chance can't take that chance Everybody in 
and then, yeah, that was... <sighs> Interesting! This game is... We got, we got a lot going on. Mess that up. Close, okay? There we go. Okay. At least the sprinkler system's going off over here. There's no fire. Hmm. Now we're gonna need Aiden. No, there's a path right here. Never mind. Oh, I'm just supposed to hold it. Okay. Got it. Oh! Oh, fun! The condenser is close. I can feel the echo on the other side. Let's take it really slow. Maybe we can slip through unnoticed. Yeah, there we go. Got it. Oh, great. We have multiple now. Behind you. Come on! I 
First time there. We don't have anything on us though. No reason to have the intensity there. Alright, we have more dead bodies, which means we can have more enemies going against us here. What the Oh, that's not good. That is really not good. the other side. I run. You protect me from the entities, okay? Got it. Let's go. <laughs> oh wait, am I playing as her and Aiden's playing as himself, I'm assuming at this point. I don't like 
gonna be sore tomorrow I would think I didn't I didn't are, are you there oh no Or maybe she's older than I thought she was. Is this after training? No, I didn't still hear. I thought I'd lost you. Okay. I'd be exhausted if I were her. Holy. Jody. Oh, I should have never sent you there. It's my fault. It's all my fault. My God, I was so afraid I lost you. Don't let them ever do that again. If they open a passage, there'll be nothing left. He seems to care about her more than her own father does.
After such an intense chapter, that's where we're going to end today's episode. If you guys have enjoyed the series so far, don't forget to give it a big old thumbs up as well as leave all your comments down below. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscription button, ding that notification bell so you guys don't miss my videos when they go live next. And until the next episode, I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Bye!